So today we're going to another golf resort. I think it's called Morsa Golf Resort. No, golf. That's what it's called, Morsa Golf. Sorry, I should get that right. So we're just going in now. Another place I haven't been to. Continue straight, then you will arrive at your destination. Just a reminder, left hand corner, there'll be a list of videos there to do with this subject. Now below the video as well will be all the information you need to know about the video, be where I am, the stuff that I use, I'm all about the equipment, the music. Also don't forget to ring the bell on YouTube. That reminds you when I'm bringing out my next video. Now I'll bring out videos twice a week. I'm trying to keep it to Tuesdays and Thursdays. But yeah, ring the bell. And uh, you can carry on now. You have arrived. Oh. Hola. Hola. Do you speak English? Yeah. Yeah, good. I'm just going to visit the golf course. The golf course is close. It's close, is it? Yeah. Can I just have a look at the complex then? Yeah. Yeah? Do you want my resident? No. No? Gracias. Well, that, that said it straight away. Um, so, the golf course is shut. I know that this is another place that hasn't been finished, but what was quite unique of this place was it's got three golf courses. Each golf course has got nine holes, so you've got 27 holes. And what you could have done is you could have, um, so I'm just going around at the moment. And we'll have a look around at some of the places. Yeah, and it, what you could do is mix it up. So you didn't have to pay, obviously, 26 holes. You could just do 18 hole. That was the thing. And each golf course had a name. I haven't got it on me at the moment, so I'll, I'll mention that later on. But at the moment, we're just going to have, have a drive around. Now, I'd imagine, looking at some of the properties there, this would still be a, a community place. It's a... It's, Looking at it from down on Google Maps, uh, it looks a huge complex. And what I love about this place, when I drive past it, usually when I'm going down towards La Tour, um, the outside wall looks a bit like a, a Fred Flintstone sort of effect, or a Greek effect. It's amazing, I'll have to show you this when I'm coming out, but yeah, I just want to have a look. I can see a golf course over there but he did say the golf course is closed. But somebody else did tell me that this has been taken over by uh, some, a Scottish guy, I don't know if that's true. Now I can just see a golf course to my right then. Okay, where should we go? Right, so that would have been a shop there and a restaurant. Looks like it's all shut down. Such a shame some of these places. Okay, it looks like I've just driven out of the complex now. <laughs> okay, there's a gate there. What is that for then? What's the gate for? It's, it's such a shame some of these places that you go to that where the you know obviously just run out of money or well, they haven't got the right investment. But they obviously been um, looking after the trees and whatever. They're all being pruned back. So there's another golf course there I can see to my right. We'll have a, we'll have a nose soon. I'm just going to have a bit of a drive around, see what we got. I mean, whatever. Obviously, they're going to need a lot of work. Now, some of these bare bits of land would have been obviously planned for a housing. There's a big house here to our right. All locked up. Looks like. Nobody's been living in that one. Now 
it's, it's knowing where to go, isn't it? <laughs> well, something's obviously been going on over there to the left. Auto, whatever. Uh, now that could be an estate agency. Uh, because it's obviously all been spruced up. Got, yeah, it's an estate agent. Okay, we have, a, we, have a, we have a nose down there. There's not much around here. Do I go over there and see if I want to buy a, a villa? <laughs> but looking at it, looks like they are. I mean, it looks like a golf course going down the middle there, and I can see the hoses on it, which looks nice and green. So maybe they're getting it up and ready. I don't know. So anybody's what? Anybody that actually lives here, that would be interesting to get a bit more information. What's on going on? Uh, because some of these places are being revamped. You know, they've been taken over by other companies now, and obviously money's starting to come back into them. I'm trying to get to, there's another big housing area in front of us. I've come to a, a lock gate. <laughs> it is, isn't it? It's a gate that's shut. Oh, bugger. Right. So maybe I'll be coming in at another angle. Okay. Okay, I'm on one of the golf courses. Now, obviously, they're obviously putting them together again. Um, they've just obviously there's a fence around the path there. I've got the old sprinklers on. Uh, looks like they cleaned up all the. I mean, you know me. I don't know much about golf, but it, they've definitely cleaned it up, and they got the old water sprayers out there, getting the grass ready. So they're obviously getting the, the courses ready. Okay, I've, I've just had a bit of a walk about. Um, they're obviously doing a lot of work here. They're getting these greens back up and running again. But I, I walked down to that road to the the right there, just have a nose at the. Now they're getting on with it, and a security guy come up, drove up in his car, and said, um, I'm not allowed up there, which is understandable. Yeah, he said it's just for the workers only. So, he, and he was ever, ever so polite. He just asked me not to go up that bit. And I asked him about, can I get over to the housing area? And he said, yes, I can go, but I've got to go back down towards the front. So I'm gonna do that in a minute and have a look. I will see if I can get into some of these um, bits that have been fenced off, I suppose. But obviously it looks like I'm being watched. <laughs> but that, that's what you get, see, when you live on a, a golf complex. They've got cameras everywhere, even a place like this that's obviously not fully functional yet. They're still watching it, which is good to see, because obviously I could have been somebody who was up to no good. So that, that's nice to see that, um, you know, you've been watched. So I'm coming back through. I mean, you know, this bit looks really nice, I must say. I haven't got a clue where I'm going. <laughs> Uh, another thing I haven't seen yet is anybody walking about, but looking at some of the properties, obviously they are lived in. Now, no doubt it's a bit of a mixture. It looks like you've got villas and apartments. And I would say looking at that place to the right, 
that could be a, it could have been a hotel I don't know whatever it is it ain't open now no, I think because that's the entrance that's I'm doing right I'm just jabbing to myself now so I want to imagine the complex I just gone past on the right was probably the shopping area um, didn't look not as much going on there So what I'm doing now, I'm going to try and get back to that other housing area that I saw, that, which I couldn't get to. So this is another housing area. Now I don't know about shops, I haven't seen, um, there's a guy there walking about with his shopping bag, so unless he's bought it somewhere, and looks, also looks like it's a gated complex, yeah, so that, that's, that's also nice to know, so nobody can just walk about like me, having a nose, <laughs> unless, you've got a, unless you've got a card obviously. So, sorry about that guys, I can't um, have a nose about. Alright, so they, they blocked the road off anyway, so I'm not be able to get up around the back anyway. Can't even see really if people are living in them. I can see chairs out, so no doubt it must be. So these look, obviously look like apartments. How long it's been here, I don't know. I mean, when I did a search on the internet, I came up with the golf site. Obviously there it told me information about the free golf courses. And that was back in 2002. So that's possibly how old it is. But like I said before, if anybody actually lives there, it'd be great if you could add some comments below the video Especially if anybody's interested in moving out this part. Uh, looks like we've got a fruit man down here selling these wares. Maybe not. <laughs> no, it's not a fruit man. It's a it's a builder. <laughs> Obviously doing the uh, the paving slabs then. Yeah, I reckon this place to the right here. And, and even though they are tidying it up, looks like the shopping area. Um, but it doesn't look like there's much going on in there. Well, if anything, nothing going on in there. But it's got to be, it's got to be some shops around here. But looking in there, that's all been taped off. Yeah, it's all taped off. I don't want to push my luck too far. I don't want to get um, asked to be lit. There's a restaurant there, because I can see some tables out. Maybe. Not Nothing at the moment. Uh, it's just interesting, I haven't seen anybody walking about yet. But they've definitely tidied up some of the gardens to make them look nice. Right, I think when I looked on the on the aerial map that there was another complex the other side, so I'm gonna have a nose at that. As if we we can get to it, if not. It, it always interests me these palms. Um, some of them 
obviously they've got different names for these palms. Now there's a golf buggy there. But there's definitely no <laughs> there's no golf going on at the moment. But looks like they're obviously sorting it out. So as they say, watch this space. There's one here to my right, it's definitely not definitely not happening. Let's overtake the golf buggy. Plus it's gonna be a bit of a slow drive. So this is obviously the other housing area. There's a security guard down at that gate. So this looks a bit more lived in here. A bit more gardeny stuff. Fashion windmill over there. Now, I've probably just gone too far now. <laughs> I have, haven't I? Hopefully, I can just turn around. Now, over to my far left now, there is another golf resort. Now, we will be having a look at that one in a couple of weeks' time. But I wanted to have a look at this one. Been wanting to look, look at this one for quite a while now. I noticed some of the gardens have got that artificial grass. See what he's doing. That's a rental. So obviously you got holiday makers here. <laughs> he was lucky he didn't get a dent in his fan then. Obviously he wasn't expecting anybody to come out. In. Okay, I'm going to go back to the sales office and just see if I can get some gunf on what's been going on. Right now, now these golf courses. Now this golf course here to my left. Now you can't see it, but that was called Olive, uh, and there was one called Stone, and there was one called Pine. Why I don't know, but. That's the names that it had. Now we've got a car park here. Obviously for all the people that wanted to play golf. Okay, so I went into the sales office. Uh, lovely, young, lovely young lady who can speak really good English and she was explaining to me that they are changing the name I'm going to put the name below now because uh, I did ask her what it was <laughs> and uh, I didn't really understand it and right on the sales office it actually got the new, the new name I think it's Altana Golf and Country Park something like that anyway can't remember now um, anyway she said to me I said to, she had three models there of the, the villas uh, and she wasn't 100% sure what the cost was, but she did get, did get to a figure of 500,000. I mean, they looked really big villas. They were modern looking villas that you see in the UK now, these sort of like what I call shoebox villas. Um, yeah, really nice, sort of black and, well, gray and white, really streamlined. Looked to quite a big plot. 
but she wouldn't let me video him. But what she did say was, if I come back after the 19th of September, they actually start building the properties around here somewhere. She said they're going to build three show houses, which was obviously the three uh, modules that were in there by November, sort of late November. And they did say that the, these two golf courses would be open by then as well. So obviously they've been given the investment and I, it's like anything else. As long as they sell them, then obviously more will get built. So that, that's nice to see, you know. So things are picking up in Spain. Um, I've been around a couple of these golf resorts. The Hacienda, the Dalimo, uh, they had their hotel bought, uh, they pumped a lot of money in there, they've got a nice big sports complex now. Still a long way to go, but you know, it's, it's coming along. Obviously a lot of Northern Europeans are coming here now. So, sorry guys, it ain't a lot to see, but what I'm hoping to do, I'm going to catch along Nick because Nick's coming back, I think, for a week. I think he said he's coming back in November sometime. I'm going to see if I can bring him out with me because he knows all about golf. I don't know a lot about golf. Um, and so hopefully we can pick up a little bit more gen. Have a look, see if we can have a look at these show houses as well. That would be interesting. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to, I'm going to drive out the complex now. you got some idea. So somebody's been putting some money into this place, which is nice. So hopefully this shopping area that's to our right now will be up and running by then, maybe, I don't know. And as I keep saying, anybody that lives here, it'd be nice to know your input, because I, I, I haven't got no information what's going on, other than I did hear that the, the banks have let go of some of the properties. So I'm going to go out the gate now. I bet there's security here saying, well, thank God for that. <laughs> not, the, not the grandest of entrances, but still a lovely en uh, entrance. Like an old sort of viaduct bridge. Guys, let me out. Hope you can see that all right. Now it's got lights there as well, so in the evening this is all lit up. Okay, I'm going to turn around now, if I can. <laughs> I think I can, yeah, I can, I can do it. Right. So that would have been a, an entrance into it. Looks like a big, it, to me, it, well, it could be a drastic part, I don't know. Hope you enjoyed that. Not one of my best videos for showing a golf resort because I didn't really get out and have a good old nose around, but it wasn't much point really. Most of the buildings were um, shut up anyway. But you could see that something was going on. Some money being put in there, an investment. They're building some brand new villas. So as always, say, keep watching guys. Because you don't know what I'm gonna bring out next. And I'll be back to this place, hopefully to cover the new build. And uh, yeah, keep watching. And I'll catch you on the next video.